Hello everyone, welcome back to Place the Spire. First, we look at yesterday's daily. Did we get good? No. Eh, top 50. Always happy with top 50. Now, today's daily, we're quite late, so we have a better idea of where we land up with, with our score. This is very high points. 1450 for the top page? Ooh, 1450 is hard. But we have Brewmaster Lethality of Order on the defect. That is at least interesting. Lethality, I don't like that much on the defect. Right, we have Horder. Horder on the other end I like a lot and then freaking Brewmaster Horder means all the potions. All of them. So there's three elites if we go that route. So once we go here, probably the few question marks. Let's see what we got. Look at the damage. I was hoping we'd get one of the damage potions so we could kill him. Okay, we'll drink this for sure. Twelve. Block everything. And regen if you're back. Okay, we got there. Now discard this. Okay, I'm I'm okay with these uh, potions in the end. Oh, we should have we should have let the we could have healed for three if I didn't attack. My bad. Okay, here we are at our first crossroads. Do I take go for the Iso Turbo with a cheap deck? Or do I go defragment, upgrade all three of them, and then go for some focus deck? I think defragment is better in vacuum. Remove a card from my deck? Nah. I don't think I want that. I guess Melter is better here. 10. That should be enough block, and then we poison you. Okay. Let's see. Don't want the smoke bomb. And then zap dual cast. Very nice. Next. I will take the charge battery. It's a, it's a good defend and the extra energy we need. Actually, I, I think I'm okay with chill here. Make you weak. Yeah, give me, give me another focus. I need this. Hit you for 20. No defense except for the four we've taken here. Still pretty good. Now, if I strike, we win. If I defend, we have another turn. So, get rid of the Gambler's Brew. Get rid of the Ancient Potion. That's a nice hand for the first floor, I think. Just evoke it. Oh, three claws? Oh no, I wanted to take Cool Headed Snap because... We need frost orbs with our focus. Frost orbs are incredible. But claws get stronger. Fast. And three of them. Each claw we play gets stronger and there there's lethality. I think we'll take the claw. And I might actually... Actually, should have ch checked the boss. We should have kept the thorn potion probably. On the one end. On the other end it's probably too early so we're fine still. Give me the energy. We have 12 block, we could make one of them weak. Why not? Still take three. But now we have a lot of energy. Claw. Zap, strike. Okay. We got the kill.
This will heal us for five at least. Maybe get another heal potion? No, it's still pretty good. What? We don't heal for five? Lightning orbs track trigger first? I'll take more charge battery, sure. Okay, now we can start smithing stuff. I want zap smith. I want dual cast smith. And then yeah, I want to smith the focus the powers. Uh gimme the energy. Give me the focus. Discard this one. Okay, we are, we are doing a few setup turns here. Okay, I think this is the end of the setup turn because we can put three poison on there and heal ourselves. That is a lot of freaking poison. Ooh la la. Won't get the perfect. I will kill him in the first go through. Actually, forty. We could kill him right now with two of the with two potions. I'd rather do it like this. Kill him without the potions. That worked out perfectly. I didn't think that would work out that great. Do I want the chaos? Do I want the steam barrier? Do I want neither? I'm not sure. Steam barrier is not the greatest block. It's free on the other hand. And while we want to play all our alchemizers. I do I do I actually do the dual cast? I think I'll upgrade. I could also start upgrading the alchemizers, but I think I'll upgrade our defragments now. Tax on bribed is pretty good. Let's hope at one of our question marks we can take curses. Gambling chip. I don't need this. I don't need this. We have defragment and then two blocks. They're taking for eleven. Zap, let's see. That's a block. That's a kill. Didn't use all our energy. But this go did this went really well actually. Anthropic brew, interesting. I will block again, and I will hit here, hit here. Oh, Claw's already doing 10 damage. A scaling, I tell ya. I don't think weakness is that good. I don't think the dexterity portion is that good. And there's the vulnerability again. I'd rather have the power portion, to be honest. Cold snap. Cold snap channels frost orbs and you want frost orb channeling if our plan is getting focus up. Let's see. We drink the energy potion. We drink a power potion. Get the buffer in here. Why not? Throw one at you. Damn. That's a kill. That's not a kill. It's more block though. Actually the same block we would have gotten if I... That's fine. We can claw here. We can play these two. We can pass the turn. Now any attack gets the, little, the third one dead. Should have probably... We won't want fairy in a bottle. No, no, no. Our stack sounds great until we realize that 15 of our cards exhaust themselves. I think I'm taking Barrage actually. 
Barrage scales on strength, it hits multiple times. Yeah, we're, we're doing this. Yeah, we're doing this. I'm fighting another pair of elites, sure. Look at the barrage! Okay, first... 14, that's good enough, and then we hit... Oh, I could have gotten the kill, but I don't think it's needed. We have 5 energy next turn due to our charge batteries. I wanna kill here. I wanna barrage. Do this. Okay. We're perfect in this fight. Oh boy. That went a lot better than I thought it would. And there's a third barrage even. Now, power potion is better than this. Ah, uh, but yeah, I'm taking more claws. Remove a card, transform a card, upgrade a card. You know what? I mean, transforming could be good, but it could also be bad. As all things. I guess quite a few cards I felt were kind of useless if I transform into them now. On the other end, there's also quite a few cards that could immediately basically win us the game. Now, I'm not going to remove. I go, will upgrade one of our defragments to a defragment plus, or I will transform probably one of the steam barriers. Question is, which is it? Which, which am I going to do? Now, trans transforming is more risky, but let's do it. It's pretty good. I'm happy with that outcome. Now, that seems like a good setup turn, actually. I will keep that hand. A zap is nice. Charge battery for next turn. We can power potion. Biased cognition? Okay. Now it's not a great setup turn anymore because we're breaking through. But well, this is this is this is working. Dual cast the fragment charge battery, so alchemize first. Take four plated armor, that's four block, that's eight block. It's not enough block. Can we get some block here? Hey, it is enough block. Hey, it's a buffer. Oh, I don't need to have enough block. Beautiful. Hey, look at that. It's a, it's another freaking buffer. Yeah, I'll keep that. Okay, that's another perfect elite. Even more claws. We could have so many claws. I could have taken even more barrages as well. They are kind of really strong because we start with two for already. It's already hitting twice at least. So it's seven times two. It's basically a dual strike. Now reboot on the other hand. I like a lot. So I'm taking reboot here. Might not be the right decision. We will see. Hopefully it is the right decision. <laughs> we can reboot into more claws, that's the thing. Now I want this. I kinda don't need this. Oh yeah, give me the defragment plus. Give me the cold snap. Give me the sunder. Go here, and I guess we take the focus portion and that's it. 12 blocks what I need. That is enough block. So we poison. Hell yeah, it's the essence of steel. Be doubly sure that this is enough block. 22 is what you need. 16 is what you need. Damn it. That is not enough block. 
That hurts. Deep in my soul. We're only at 11, I need 5 more block. Now, with us losing the perfect, I might as well attack. I couldn't charge another orb because we couldn't get block up front. If I had any block and the frost charge would have been good, but we weren't. Give me the energy, we should have probably done this first as well. Uh, Sunder? We buffer the repose, play a new buffer, play alchemize and reboot, maybe into some steam barrier, maybe reboot into some claws. No. And there you go. That one turn where we had to attack with the cold snap and took some reflect damage screwed us. Oh, I want rainbow and I want echo form. Question is, which one will I take? Ah, losing the beyond perfect here is terrible for us. A rainbow or echo form? I feel like echo form is still the better play. Choose and add five cards to your deck? I don't think so. Removing two is pretty bad. Max HP by five? Upgrade a random card? Yeah, come on. I actually like this potion. And I do like ball lightning as well. One elite. There's a second one, there's a second one. I like the early shops here. Instead of no shop again. So this... This elite fight, that, that boss fight was messed up. I kind of really hate that. Of course, we start with Echo Form. Nah, I don't think I want to double up on Echo Form. That would be too much. Maybe get some claws? No. It's okay. Single Lycoform form is already strong enough. Hell yeah, I'm taking the white noise. Give me more powers. We don't want buffer for sure. I don't want this as well. That is freaking scary what's going on here. Come on. It's like... Absolutely spooky. The birds in a lethality daily is way too strong. And I don't have enough attack strength. Give me something. Yes! That's the something I need. I mean, we're taking so much damage here. But at least they're taking damage as well. I will take Compile Driver, it's card draw. A lot of card draw with our different ones. I like Finesse. More Defragment is nice. And these are all really good. Kinda like the Bronze Scales still. Now this is 100, it's 170, it's 470 if I take these two and that. And to be honest, that's kind of really good loot. I don't need this. Let's see. Play here. Charge battery. Uh, claw. Defrag claw. Charge one. Charge two. Reboot. Maybe I should have rebooted first. Yeah, I should have rebooted first. Still costing three A. Eh?
my bad. I forgot the echo form. Oh my god, we're dying! Stop it, please. That's enough block already, okay. I'm hoping for something that heals us. Didn't get that. Still no heals, but we get a kill. Down to 19, eh? If we do not have a scrape yet. Ball Lightning would give us 25 points for another card where we have four more of, but Ball Lightning is kind of not great here, I think. Do I want Sweeping Beam? It's AoE. Yeah. Block Potion. Nothing worth here, right? Start with three boot sequences? Nah, we can't. Yeah, we can. We have gambling chip. We can keep as many. We have basically we never take damage on the first turn. No, we have to heal. And of course, we're taking the cold snap. I know hologram is great, but cold snap is so good in a focus deck. Let's see how much damage we taken. 20, 30, 41. So I'm probably taking all three of these. Thirty-seven, thirty-nine, thirty-seven. Very good. I actually needed all three boot sequences here. Damn that! That is a dangerous, dangerous elite fight. Kill one. Now we need twenty-five block. Buffer blocks the first bit of damage, and then we still take ten. Is there anything else we can do? So freaking close. Like I, I will t play buffer. No wait, this is this is good. We take no damage here because we go up to sixteen. It blocks the first one, and buffer blocks the second one. Gets a kill. Twenty. Okay, we can we can kill him here. I have so many cards, I think Turbo is pretty good. And I think 40 HP is good enough that we can continue upgrading our defragments. It's by far our strongest oh, meat to the bone. Good that we didn't rest, because now if we take a bit of damage, it's fine. We only need two boot sequences. I think we only need one boot sequence here. Now I start with Cold Snap, Compile Driver. The boot sequence is good enough. Finesse, Defragment, Claw, we can reboot. Yeah, let's, let's retry this. Two more Claws. Very good, we killed him. Resummoning is what he's doing. So we cold snap, defragment, alchemize, reboot again. It's unfortunate, especially since I played the, uh, the non upgraded defragment and got an upgraded defragment immediately. I will use this. It's so sad. Okay. I kill him and then I do the get the dark op in here. But do I want to double up on cold snap? We take eight block from playing double up on cold snap. This is fourteen block. This seems better. Now let's see how much block do we need. This is actually enough block. Double up white noise for sure. 
Get another echo form in rather than this in here. Draw on a card, a second alchemize. Yeah. Mm. So much block. I kinda want more space. Ten, ten. Now we have nine block from our each frozen orb. Should have probably played the alchemize on the other end. This is a good setup we have right here. Double up on storm. Double up on loop. Deal 19 damage here and then kill him. Mummified hand. Hell yes. So more white noise with mummified hand. I kind of want the essence of steel. Over the both are defensive potions. How much do we need? 18, 28, 34. Okay, so we take the boot sequences. So I take everything here. Thirty-four? That's wrong. Ah still. It it gives us an additional energy next turn. Oh yes. I will play turbo. I will draw some cards. Alchemize. Zeb. Discard this one, alchemize. I want the buffer. Strike is free now and then we reboot. Claw. Gambler's Brew. White Noise, Hello World is makes Alchemize free. Play Alchemize. Get the strength, play this. Maybe we can get something else. Block, it's good enough, we have a we have a buffer. So the damage is buffered. Double up on this, come on, gimme. Oh, it's on a double up. My bad. Seven and six. It's actually thirteen. Whew. Lucky. Now we double up on this. And then we play this. And then everything is free. It's probably the weakest one. And there you go. I like off of the eyes. I like the second sweeping beam though. And I think strength potion is better than fear potion. Again we continue upgrading. Where is it? There's the defragments. I kinda want the white noise as well, but no. Or we could upgrade our buffers. But no, I think defragments are what, what's gonna carry us. Sixteen block. So this is good enough, and then we don't need this. We don't need this. Hold your god. So we play this, we play this, we play this, we play this. We have three echo forms on turn one? What? That doesn't seem right. I wanted to take the strength potion, but then I do realize now I want the alchemist potion, especially against this suffer debuff. Okay, and then we hit, and we hit, and we hit, and we hit, and we hit. Holy moly, that's really good. It's so good with Mummified Hand. I'm gonna upgrade all strikes and defenses. I will upgrade another defragment. Let's hope we don't need that much. 
we can get rid of all our block. This is good. Play this. Give, give me energy back. I want this. Alchemize. That's focus. I like that. Oh! Yes! 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 All these. I shouldn't have played that. Actually, Mummified Hand allowed us to play every single one. Now I double up on the buffer. Yes. For sure. Make two free. This one draws us three cards. Finesse draws us another card. Take the focus. Alchemize. Drink this because why not? Draw another card. Turbo. Alchemize and then we reboot. That's a zap, that's free. Now I want this one. And then 50 50, hit the buffer. Ah, we can't have everything. You're taking my echo form. So we double up this. Then we play this here. And now we get all the echo forms in hand. I have four echo forms now. That's a fair fight. I don't even need to block. We have 15. We have 13 focus, block at 15 per frost orb. Double up on white noise. Double up on heat sinks. Double up on echo form. Double up on white noise. Ah, we don't have enough. Stop doubling up, please. Okay. Now can I finally please play some cards? Double up on white noise. No, it's a single white noise. Right, that's it's still still okay. Sweeping beam, claw, sweeping beam, compile driver, draw, compile driver, reboot. Wait, I don't have to. I can kill him. Might as well. So absolute ridiculous brutality. I'll take reboot over seek. Get me, give me the curse key. That's beautiful. Because we still have. That's three curses we get, and I get need some way to gain more curses, and then we'd have the curse as well. One elite, two or two here. Now the one with more question marks probably the one we want to take, and that's this one. Oh, there's two question marks on this road. There's one question mark on that road. And we get an early shop on this one. On this one we won't, but it's more question marks. Question marks are chances for curses. I only need one defend, one boot sequence, the rest we can get rid of. Play this. Hit you with this. Hit you with a sweeping beam. Let's see what we get. Let's see what we get. Nah. Sweeping beam. Four lightning. That is 15. That is not enough. So I'm taking this already. We're taking some damage here. It's fine though. Make you weak. Get an attack in here. That kills you, right? Yeah. Unfortunate. Okay, I'm taking stack here. Maybe darkness would have been better. Get me a curse, a relic, gold, 
Anything. Give me curse. That's card that's the card removal. I want a curse. We can remove a card from our deck. Which is the worst card? I honestly don't know. Actually, dual cast is the worst card. It's not upgraded. Strikes and defense are upgraded, they're kinda useful. 12, so I want one of these. Oh, that didn't work out. Now, Thorny Boys are a bit annoying. I needed more than 15 blocks so I wouldn't take any damage. I can't attack, I will take damage. Self repair? I like it. Let's see, white noise, static discharge, defend, defend, and then we can hit him once. Oh yes, I'll take another focus potion. I yes, I'll take another cold snap. Best card in my deck. I don't need any defense at all. Very nice. Claw strike. Hit him with the fire potion. Strike reboot. Let's see what we can do here. Perfect, we block and a debuff. That is enough block and then we still have one energy left to maybe get something good here. We could have played the charge battery to get another energy over here. Okay, this way we don't take any damage. We would have taken two otherwise. I'll take more turbo. With turbo we can play all our hands always. How much do we need? 20 something. So two of these, that's 22. That's good enough. White noise. Okay, we artifact the deep negative debuff of bias cognition. And then we play boot sequence, boot sequence, ball lightning, alchemize and reboot. Finesse and zap sound like good ones. Should have played this before zap though. It still continues. Very good turn I'd say. Excellent turn. So we hit, hit, play this. This is free and then get some blocking. One will respawn sadly. But now we even have echo form. I don't think I want that. I will take cool headed. That's card draw. That's important. Now an elite. How much do we need? No block at all. Get rid of all of this. Damn, the f it, so many innate cards and gambling chip is incredible, pow incredibly powerful. Let's see. Oh, the sneeze. <coughs> so. I have only a few attacks. Turbo. Strike. Get the attack in here. Come on, some card draw. Sadly, it didn't work out. We have three energy left at the end of this one. Rebound. Cool headed. We. I mean, 
Defragment has a chance to get Echo Form. If I play Charge Battery, the chance is higher. It's 1 in 3. How did that even happen? That shouldn't have happened. It did though. Absolutely amazing. Let's see, we double up on this. Play two of these, make two free. And we start another power. We need capacitance, another one free. Uh, damage him a bit. Poison him a bit. Get this Sunday in here. Okay. Charge battery is nice. Turbo is nice. Ball lightning. Get it with a big Sunder and then reboot with three energy. Boot sequence. And then I guess ball lightning, ball lightning, cold snap. But look how much slow that is. All of this attack does over three, da uh, over thirty damage. Double up on these, then we double up on these, then we double up on these, then we can double up on these. And now I can draw some more cards. Then let's see. This should be all the doubles ups, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Claw. Rebound. Hit him. Hit him. We had a billion echo forms. Hell yes, cool headed plus. Sequence apparently. The Ness boot sequence. Alchemize. Alchemize. Crap. Couldn't get the buffer in. This is damage, defragment, echo form, turbo, and then reboot. Five energy left. On the fan, and then the sweeping beam. Another turbo. We can strike here and then reboot with four energy. The Ness. Charge battery is good enough. Still pretty good, I think. Double up on Echo Form, make the rest through free. We double up on Boot Sequence. We double up on Cold Snap. I will take Core Search for sure. The artifact is really, really good. Of course, we fight for a Relic. Where are the curses though? I only need one. Let's see, we play that. Defragment makes completed free. Defragment makes cold snap free. And then we can do this. Move through here. Give me, give me new cards. Ooh. See what we get. Didn't quite get there. Maybe you should have played turbo and only drawn two cards. Play this. Poison one of these. Now we take one damage if I do the sweeping beam. That's smart. No. I'll take my four damage instead. Calcum together with our block. Amazing. It's pretty good. Leave more block. Turbo. Yeah, we can play the strike still. Ninja. 
Ninja Regen Potion. I think this time it's time for the hologram. Pain is good enough. I just want I just want curses, please. Two, one. I think one is enough here. Since we'll boot sequence. Core search. Let's see. Get the strength. Alchemize. No 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 no. Cold snap. Charge battery. Hologramming wouldn't have been worth it. Let's see. White noise. Play this. Play this. Play it here. And we reboot with three energy. So white noise. Creative eye. Yeah, we're playing everything again. More charge battery. Sure, why not? Recharge battery, that's 7 energy this turn. And we have an echo form. That's wrong. Wait, we play boot sequence first and then we hit him. Then we can get cool headed and draw some more cards. That's a very convenient deep fragment. Crap. And crap. I should have used the potion. Now we double up on heat sinks, make two cards free, draw some cards. Let's draw some cards. I want the weakness. Alchemize. I want some block, please. Let's block. Some wood block, even. We just needed the in initial block so we can roll over. Yeah, I think Ancient Potion might be better. Give me another hologram, of course. Let's see. No, 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 no. Buffer, yes. So we. Buffer. Sweeping Beam. Grab a boot sequence, hit him with a core search. We have the incense burner. Let's see what we got. Heat six is nice. Okay. We don't have to proc our buffer yet, so everything's good. Sleeping Beam is not good enough, I'd rather reboot here. I will take it. Let's start with this, and then we can draw two cards of the Compile Driver. Do I want a second buffer? No, I don't need to, I still have one buffer for next turn. Get the region potion going. I could just pass, by the way, because I have a buffer. Up. I'd rather have the essence of steel than the region. I'll take more barrage. Okay, one more, we have one more chance to gain more block, which is all that I want. Okay, I guess we play three Echo Forms then. Wait, we play Compile River first, draw two cards, and then we can Echo Form them for free. Okay. Say that's pretty good. Freaking pain! No! That's gonna be very annoying.
<laughs> taking so much damage here. I mean, first of all, Pain hit us for a lot. And then we didn't get any block in, so he will hit us for a lot as well. Double up on Echo Form, double up on Buffer, and now everything's free. Double up on Charge, we get, we get everything doubled up. I have five Echo Forms now. What are we fighting against, by the way? Not the Time Eater, very good. Let's get two cards back. And I want back a turbo. Is this right? No reason to play anything else here. Get him. That's a bit late for a more bank, my friend. Come on. Oh no. No. This is a way we gain curse. And no curse will give us curse, that's 100 points, and we gain max HP. So I think I am healthy is the right decision here. Now, if we get the beyond perfect of this one, this would be better, but I don't think it is. So I will this gain cursed bribe gave us but gave us only six oh it doesn't triple up right but now we have more than five cars in our deck and it's really nice uh, no need to play any defense at all give me something else please eh. we're playing this we're doing this Cards. Claw, hologram, turbo. Oh my goodness. I guess it wasn't as great as I hoped it would be. First we draw some cards. We play turbo, we play hologram, get back all four. Play echo form. We play all for one. Claw. We have one good sequence, two good sequence. We need 29 block. That is 29 block. So I don't need the third good sequence. That's pretty good. Yeah, I've taken more buffers, sure. What can we upgrade? One last defragment. Get in here. Give, give me all the focus. So we start with focus. And we start with... How much do we need? Two blocks? Yeah. And we start with this. Not the greatest power, but I'll take it. Okay. Drink. Buffer is nice. Hit. Good sequence, good sequence. Of course we turbo and reboot. I hate it. Actually we can get the artifact in here as well. We have enough blocks still for the awakened one. Is it plus seven strength? Much, isn't it? Let's see. That is far too much. Don't we have buffers? Where did the buffers go? Oh! Pain got rid of all the buffers! No! That's bad. I think I have to. Do I have to alchemize here? Crap, 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 crap. Come on. Crap! There goes the perfect.
that's so cheap. I shouldn't have played the Alchemist. I thought we get card draw energy. Any of these is really good. I didn't. I didn't calculate it good enough. So my bad. This is the only time we're taking damage here. The, the fight is basically won. Can't believe we lost buffers to the freaking pain. I should have just stopped playing. I, I forgot. I completely forgot. That was just sad. We don't have any buffers, so I'm this and I guess another read. Do we need steam barrier? I don't think so. We might as well play it. No, we didn't need it. We we, we have enough block. Get me all the all the block please. Turbo buffer and barrage I guess. Now look at look at the amount of block we're getting from our frost orbs. I hate pain. I absolutely hate it. This is 40, 60 something. This is 16, 16, 17, 17. We're good enough here. powers. Finally, I am free. <sighs> that we should have we should have perfected this. I just huge misplaced. And look at how strong our clauses are by now. Twenty five? We have no chance, we're just rebooting in new hands where everything's free suddenly. Oh, he's dead. So our deck was very strong and I enjoyed this, but our points are kinda... Okay, they're pretty high. That's front page material. Without the perfect? Really? If I only didn't take... If I didn't take that damage? If I didn't I play into, if we still had the buffer because I play, didn't play, like after the reboot on the first turn, if I just kept and was like, well, this is fine, and kept the buffers instead of preventing two damage from the pain, we could have perfected the last one, that's 50 more points, and if we weren't unlucky that one turn on, we, had, we could have had 150 more points. Crap. So the curses is important. That's why I wanted the curses so much. Well fed, of course. Easy with Darkstone Peribed. Encyclopedian, easily. Collector, I try to get there as hard as possible. As you can see, I took all cards we took twice, so we have six of them, so collector procs. At least that's, that's why I, what I tried. Like we have these twice, these twice, Turbo twice, Sweeping Beam twice. That took reboot of a Surge because of that, to get more points with Collector. These are twice. Hologram twice, this is another one of these. So I tried and I think we got a lot of points there. I like it. So when I started that was front page. Let's see. Oh look at that! Without the perfect Wow! So I I, I originally thought I'd end this with I had a lot of fun and this was a great deck and I felt we did, made many right decisions but we lost the perfects. I guess if I perfected one we'd be at here and if we perfected twice we'd be at sixty we'd be be six if we get the one hundred and fifty points for the beyond perfect. That's the difference. 
It's now I know I, I could have been top. I mean, this is 1855 is ludicrous, but we could have been up there. Uh, bit disappointing, but other than that, fun daily and a lot of fun, and it worked out really well. So I hope you guys enjoyed it. Thank you for watching. I will see you in the next episode.